attorney says that Hillary can be charged with 13 crimes. There are a lot of people that think Hillary Clinton has committed crimes but this may be the first time that a total of 13 crimes has been calculated. In this segment from Hannity, you will hear the phrase that somebody has to go to jail. That was spoken by a Fox Network attorney. 13 is a hefty number and there are those who think that it only scratches the surface. As written by Rusty Vice for Men Rec. We know how you feel about this one, you'll believe it when you see it. And we get that, especially with all the false starts and stops over the years that would have landed ordinary people in jail. Still, it's interesting and newsworthy when an attorney says he's looked at the facts of the Uranium One scandal and believes that somebody's got to go to jail over it. Legal analyst and Fox News attorney Greg Jarrett made just that assertion when he appeared with Sean Hannity on Fox News, claiming Hillary Clinton could be charged for 13 potential crimes. 13 potential crimes committed by Hillary Clinton, she'd be charged for six anti-corruption, they were all felonies, Jarrett analyzed. She could also be charged with racketeering for using her charity as a criminal enterprise and then you've got all of the email crimes, two of them under the Espionage Act and two additional. Senate Judiciary Committee Chairman Chuck Grassley has called for an investigation into the Uranium One scandal which involves the 2010 approval of the sale of Canadian mining company Uranium-1 to Russia's Rosatom nuclear company, giving the Russians control of part of the uranium supply in the U.S. Fox News reported that the FBI had evidence that Russian nuclear officials were involved in fraudulent dealings, including extortion, bribery and kickbacks as far back as 2009 who were then part of the 2010 deal approved in part by the Clinton State Department. Donations from interested parties to the Clinton Foundation, a $500,000 speaking fee for former, for former.